G'day dads, welcome to Cooking with Cameron on the Fatherhood Channel. It's great to have you along this week. But anyway, dads, time to apron up, time to get back into the kitchen. Let's have a go at the humble chicken Kiev. As I said, dads, great to have you along. And, uh, Hope you're doing well. Hope you're you going with all these recipes, all these cooks I'm doing. Hope you enjoy them. Hope you're giving them a crack, or at least it's inspiring you to get in and doing something. But anyway, dads, today, uh, the chicken Kiev. All I can think of when it comes to the chicken Kiev is those frozen chicken fillets stuffed with beautiful garlicky butter, breadcrumbs, and uh, always they're always a winner straight out of the uh, out of the freezer. But I want to have a go at doing them fresh today. But instead of doing the thigh, the, the fillets, I'm using the thigh. Now I use the thigh because it's a bit juicier, it doesn't dry out as much, and uh, so that's why I use the thigh. Um, yeah. So you can get them at your shopping centers, nice and easy. So we're just gonna make up some garlic butter, our chicken, and uh, some bread crumbing. And uh, yeah, you can serve these with a, a range of different veggies, different styles, just some hot chips even. Uh, so it doesn't really matter. But anyway, I'm gonna make these up and uh, I'll work out what I'm gonna serve them with later. Anyway, let's get into it and see what we need. So I've got a lump of butter here that's uh, just, some, it's butter, it's not margarine. I like the butter. Now, measurements are as, as you want. moments to mix together so that was a 500 gram butter block of butter that we would used a little bit of and so I've just added something there's probably about 300 grams of butter really there um, and the best thing is if you don't use all of this in your chicken you can throw it in the freezer when you want to make up some garlic bread it's there pull it out whack it on the bread shove it in the oven nice and simple so we've got our garlic butter ready that so got two chopping boards here I like the timber one, I don't usually put chicken on there because I've got to give it a big wash and a big clean. So I use a plastic one, that can go through the dishwasher, it doesn't matter. And the chopping, a good chopping board can stay clean. So it's pretty simple, I'm just grabbing the chicken Kiev, or the chicken thigh. Find a bit of garlic in the middle of it, the butter in the middle of it. Then we're gonna roll it for the moment. So we're gonna roll it. Then we're just some simple toothpicks. Jam it through. Hold it together. Now it's an interpretation of the chicken care. We've got to remember that. We're still gonna crumb them yet. So the toothpicks are there just to hold it in shape. Right here, dads, that's uh, that only took a few minutes to knock together those. Um, so I've got to be tray of thighs. Now, my family, we're not going to eat all of them. I'd say we're not gonna eat all those in one go, but knowing my son, he's growing, he will try and eat a lot of them. But anyway, now it's uh, time to get in and uh, set up a simple crumb. Right here, it's a, a basic crumb. Some sort of flour, that's to draw, to, silly. We dry it out to get it wet to dry it out. Go figure. So today I'm just using some uh, rice flour, because so that's what we had, a couple of eggs. Now my bread crumbs, I've actually mixed, put some mixed herbs in there. Uh, just a little bit extra flavour. Again, as I say, this is my interpretation of the good old chicken Kiev. Coat in flour. Egg. Pretty 
simple. Radio dads. So that's them crumbed. Now they need to sit in the fridge for uh, maybe a half hour just to let it sort of sit a bit. Now there's a couple ways we can cook it. We can either shallow fry it and then oven or shallow fry it for a, yeah, just keep it cooking for a while. Tonight I think I might actually just do shallow fry just to get it nice and golden brown on the outside and then we're going to stick it in the oven to finish it off because there's a couple of thicker pieces there. So, you know. Radio dads, as I said, I'm just going to um, just crisp these up. So we just a little shallow fry. We're just going for a browning because then we're going to put them in the oven. So this is really just for a bit of colour. Right here, dads. That's uh. There's some nice colour in those. And then I'm going to put them into the oven about 170 degrees for about 40 minutes to make sure that the chicken's all nicely cooked through. And, uh, so between now and then, I'm going to get in, cook up some veggies. I'll just going to do a little bit of cleaning up so that there's less to do later. Okay, dads, let's uh, throw those into the oven. Right here, Dad. Been about 40 minutes. Now, if we had smell-o-vision, you'd be experiencing what I am. Absolutely beautifully cooked. Chicken Kiev, my style. Thigh fillets, some uh, seasoning in the crumbs. Looks absolutely beautiful. So as you can see, that's pretty easy to pull off a chicken Kiev. So I want you to have a go. Take some photos, stick them up on social media, and uh, hashtag the cooking, cooking with Cameron, fathering channel, of course. And uh, I'd love to see how you go with your chicken Kiev. Anyway, till next time, keep being great dads.